looking for the facts Well, you done came to the right place You now checked in with Blog partner, blog partner Blog partner, blog partner Blog partner, blog partner Blog partner, blog partner Here it is, here it is It's your boy Blog Partner back up in this thing One more again What it do, what it do, what it do yeah, man, hope I catch y'all in the greatest of health and nothing else because I'm coming with the latest and what's the greatest. With that being said, I really appreciate each and every last one of y'all because y'all the reason why this thing growing legs like it's doing. So with that being said, continue to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button and keep on telling your people about me, man. Let's get straight into it. Man, I got some unfortunate news, man. Um, and there's some sports news, too. Yeah, man, um... Uh, but anyway, first I want to say shouts out to the Tennessee Titans because I went to the game Sunday. You know what I'm saying? My Titans won. We beat uh, we beat the Chargers. You know what I'm saying? In overtime, it was a, it was alright. But unfortunately, I got a situation I want to speak on that happened at the um, the Patriots and the and the Dolphins game. Man, it was a fan. It was a 30 year ticket holder. It was a guy. It was an older guy, white guy. You know what I'm saying? And uh, him and his son had had attended the game and whatnot. And um, you know, altercation happened, you know what I'm saying? He got punched in the face and he hit the ground, hit his head on the ground and never gained conscience, you know what I'm saying? And he passed away. So I wanna say uh, prayers goes out to the family of that man and my condolences go out to those to those to those family members because I'm speaking on it, but and I think it's some video footage too. Y'all can go on YouTube or whatnot and look it up, man. It is it is crazy because when you're at them games, I mean I don't know what caused the altercation, but I do know when you at those games, it's like tight. It's like if you ain't in the suite or nothing like it, if you ain't up in the suite, you know, the, 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 the seats are tight. You know what I'm saying? And then you got people drinking and, you know, all this and that, man. People be under the influence. But I don't know if that's what the situation was with them. But a lot of people do be under the influence. And it's real easy to have an altercation. Like when you get up, like when people sitting down, you got to, you know, you got to get up. You done been to the game. You know how it is. You got to get up all the time, sit down, get up, get up, all this, and let them buy. You know, I don't know what led on to it. Y'all get in the comments and let me know what y'all think led on to it. You know what I'm saying? But it just, when you go, man, you just got to go have fun, man. Just go have fun. You got to know that you got to communicate with people. You might have somebody behind you, might bump up against you. It was a man that kept bumping up against me because I was hugging my wife, you know what I'm saying? And he his, his knee or whatever kept hitting my, hitting my arm. And he was like, hey, man, I apologize. He apologized to me 30 times. I'm like, bro, you good, bro. I understand. Cause my arm is right here. I'm hugging my wife, so I understand he's getting excited, going for the you know the team and whatnot. And I know he's not bumping me intentionally. It's not hurting, but you know some people just I don't know. I don't know what happened with that man. But I just want to let y'all know, man. Um, yeah, man, a 30 year ticket holder, a New England Patriots fan. You know what I'm saying? He he died, man. He got into an altercation with a, with a Dolphins fan, and unfortunately that's what happened. I don't know if any charges gonna be brought against the man or whatnot. But as it grows more legs. I'll get back with you, so to the next time, there it is, it's over with, blog partner, I'm out of this thing. <laughs>